Hello everyone, welcome. This is Div the Sunny Panda back with another episode of Started Company. And sadly, this is going to be the last episode, at least for this season. I will continue playing Startup Company because I have developed, uh, um, I would say, hmm, what would be the correct word? A liking would be too less. I've developed a love for this game. That would be a bit odd, wouldn't it? But it's somewhere around that, you know, um, general direction. I like this game so much that I want to continue playing. And, you know, uh, currently Panda Tube it started from we, our startup company. Uh, we started when I don't know how many beta updates have been out since we started. It's been quite a while. We have managed to hit number six on the global website lists um, all the way from the bottom. And we have bought out a few companies as we climbed as well. And honestly, I couldn't even reach number one, but it would just be a grind. I would have to let the game run for a couple of hours, uh, get enough modules to upgrade my features and uh, run aggressive marketing. And I could I could get two billion in no time, you know, but it's just it's just a boring grind. Uh, no new challenge. I don't have to worry about money. I don't have to worry about my staff. The only thing that really, really bugs me is please devs it's 20.5 the version the game version and still employees that are executives ask for intermediate tasks in demands and i'm getting a 10 percent hit on the demand bonus this should be 57 percent not 47 percent i can't fulfill this and it's so annoying i'm being a good employer here uh giving them a better desk you know they're they, they want a lower desk intermediate even if I go into desks like look 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 if I go into desks um, where's the uh, freaking the desk option where do you get the desk option I completely forgot the desk option even um, where's the heck in dex desk option you get to upgrade desks and stuff right Yeah, up, oh, it's the, right there. Sorry. Okay, so they are demanding an intermediate desk, which is a downgrade of two levels. When they're experts, I don't get it. And it's been five updates after the beta, and it's it's just a small annoying thing. But it annoys me at this stage because if I would get this ten percent boost, my my staff would work even faster in pushing out those modules. I let the game run for close to an hour and a half before starting up recording because I just wanted to be in this um, uh, top 10 spot on the compet on the global list, you know. And I needed the user base for that and I needed to keep upgrading my features, which still I haven't, you know, got around to a landing page and comment are 1640 but video functionality and video editor are lacking by 200 it's just because i don't have enough modules for that and i don't have enough staff to pump out those modules good enough and that 10 percent hits hard when almost every staff member is missing that 10 percent they could be working faster and i don't know that's just a small little rant i've gone to but yeah, we've come a long way. We are making so much money per month. Um, we have no issues at all. Our server, uh, look at look at this server setup. It's fantastic. And overall, the game's the journey until now has been absolutely great. I have loved it, and I would love to start up uh, a new company with all the changes that the game has undergone, and challenge myself. Uh, with something new, I stuck to just one website, and in my neck in the next season, I plan to have multiple websites, at least minimum of two, more than two would be possible depending on how the play goes, you know. And hopefully, by the time I start up my second season, uh, the update for a bigger office is out as well. And I mean, it was told that there would be a bigger office and especially in late game i think it would help having more employees especially if you're running multiple big sites um because it takes shit ton of modules to um keep keep pushing those user number up you know so 
yeah if if you're if you're a fan of uh, management sim games um this is a wonderful little game it 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 doesn't have too much depth unlike a, a few other games but it is fun for what it is and i think i enjoyed it more because i was playing it through multiple updates and the changes and stuff i needed to adapt to it and it felt it felt sort of like uh, realistic you know because if you have a company if you have a website you need to keep up with trends you need to keep up with what's hot what's new you need to you have low downs and ups you know based on um, i think that's one thing that they could add based on seasons like historically winter season this holiday season uh, all websites see a huge increase in the number of visitors and then it drops low after winter when everybody gets back to work and during this time let's say january february and then it goes up again during the summer vacations and things like that but yeah um for what it's oh, for what you're paying for the game especially if you buy it in um a sale it's worth it i love the game i've put in more than i don't know 24 25 26 hours on the game or even maybe more than 30 hours in the game and um, i have loved i have loved uh, loved wow i have loved absolutely every minute playing this and we got so far uh, i didn't expect to do great at the beginning because uh, as i said the game was kept receiving updates and many people had complaints with a few updates in between that like ruined the earning potential and such but i got through somehow because um, i didn't uh, i didn't manipulate or misuse um the you know the system that we had before we didn't have uh, revenue making options like marketing and ads we had contracts that we, we used to get to produce modules and sell and people could basically make money by just working on those contracts rather than uh, working on the website so i didn't i didn't use that much and when the new new update came with the new revenue modules or uh, i actually preferred that and moved over to that um a lot smoother than some few others did um but ba what i'm trying to say is the game felt fresh because uh, of the constant updates and once the beta is done and the game is in cold i'm a bit worried that it could get stale especially once you reach the end game but let's see let's see what the future of this game holds we will have the second season most certainly i don't know when we may take a two to three week break from this but we'll come back to it i hope you've had um fun watching the series i have had fun making the videos so i hope you had fun watching the series following it um, i could even do some tips and tricks videos i think you know like the basic to do's to to and know what to not do and such if you want to see something like that let me know and yeah i would just love your opinion on the entire series uh, would love to hear, see a comment from you and it's a goodbye for now we'll be back with some more startup company eventually i don't know when but eventually i'll um i'll let you guys know on twitter whenever it comes back all right so see you all it's been a fantastic journey and i hope you enjoy the other content that i put up on youtube bye bye